And we're back! Time to see. You know, time to go hang out with Mr. Horsey Man. I wonder if there's going to be any music from this one. Uh, besides the top of music playing behind me. Like song music, because we can't get enough of those, apparently. Full of them in the last episode. Okay, now we walk. I'm not going to ride my bike into this place, just because I feel like he will throw me out for being rude. Obviously not, but... So this place is really just one room. His entire castle, his entire palace, is one room. And half of that is the tree. Okay, no, you can see more of that way. Okay. Acceptable. Not ideal, but acceptable. Dr. Calyrax, dang it. I've been awaiting, human child. The crown shrine is the place I once called home. Spectrum must think me helpless now that I have lost my powers. He taunts me by making this place its own dwelling. Ah, I see you have indeed brought me the reins of unity. You have my thanks, child. Why wouldn't I have them? I had them when we left. Ah, these feelings of faulty these again. The color, the way they shine more light. Oh, wow, this brings back memories. Spectre is a very proud Pokemon. One might even call it arrogant. It will not accept me as its master unless I am able to prove that my power outweighs its own. I will use the reins of unity to pour my power into the very body of my loyal steed. That should convince that I am indeed still deserving of its loyalty. Now, human child, in order to lure my loyal steed to me, place a shadow root carrot into the basket near where Spectre is made its bed. Okay, hope you guys are ready for another fight. The big one. Big one. Put the shade root carrot in there. Is that what it looks like? It looks bad. Like, it looks like it expired. Hey, it has come, human child. But you have successfully defeated my loyal steed once from already. It was not will- it would not- that it will not willingly approach anyone it considers to be a threat. We must hide and wait for it to appear. Or else I'll check. You should probably stop controlling the man, then. It's my father you're pulling around like that, man. His own daughter sucks. So I'm his daughter now. 10 out of 10 still. No way Spectre can see us. They're a little dangerous to ride a horse who's a pair of blocks and thighs. <laughs> Fiori will come just in time to spill. <laughs> Bad horse. Do I not even have to fight it again? Oh yeah. Good old horsey. Horsey boy. Horsey boy, horsey boy. So like, how illegal is this? Oh, can we see its eyes now? Oh, what in the world? Such a huge noggin. And it, it's got a ride. What? I can talk? Crown, 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 crown. What? Well, what'd you want? I, I, I have no idea what you're saying, but somehow it also makes sense. Hold the phone. What in the world are you? Oh, not again. Mer. Human child. Thanks to your efforts, I have been reunited with my loyal steed. 
Now, now I am finally at my full power. I was convinced the people no longer believed in me, and I had lost my loyal steed. I was trapped in the throes of deep loneliness. But you saved me. There truly are no words with which to fully express my gratitude towards you. So, I have a suggestion. If you are able to catch me, even with my powers restored, it will prove your worth beyond any doubt, and I will lend you my strength on your journey. Once you have readied yourself, come face me. Ah, but first, I should get this man back to where I found him. It would be no good to let him free out in this frigid climate. So is this going to be like Sachin, where it's not randomized, or is this going to be like everything else we've seen in the front row where it was? It feels story important, so it feels like it shouldn't be. Cra, cra! Do you want to ready your Pokeballs in order to catch Calyrex? Cra! Hello, Your Majesty. You're looking excellent today. Thank goodness Ashin wasn't randomized. Yeah, then the absolute cursed nature of Kelly Rex's cry coming out of Northern just now. It's been a quick ball. I have one quick ball. That's all I need for this. That is all I need for you. Ding. Oh, wow. Betamax cannon! Oh, it's fighting type, or dragon type move, isn't it? It's actually not bad on you. Ah, uh, you live this, probably. <sighs> what if it's choice facts and that's all it has, and I'll just go sit there and throw those nappers and throw ultra balls at it? I'm messed up with that right? That's the right word, that's not going to take that long. Oh, I'm so sad. I wanted a Kelly Rex instead of a horse. All that work, you know, is annoying work. <laughs> oh, for ball. Shake, shake, shake. How dare you? How dare you defy me? <laughs> What is the moveset on this thing? Imagine going from Dynamax Cannon <laughs> to Water Gun. Okay, let's see. Can we just get you? Can we just get you? You want to you come with me? Thanks, man. What king do I name this after? Obviously, I have to name this thing after a king, but what one? Alright, there is boring and obvious. I'd like to name it after the king from uh, Kuma 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 Bear, but I don't remember his name. So I'm going to call you Bacon. Because Bacon is the king of breakfast food. Bacon. I would like to send Bacon so far to the box that I'd never have to see it again. Human child, no, I shall now refer to you by your name now, Sophia. That's all I said. I look forward to what adventures we may have together. Hello, that you, Chief? It's me, Peony. I just had a dream about a big-headed Pokemon talking on and on in a weird tribe. You were there too, Chief. It all felt so real. I got worried about you and decided I'd better call you and check in. You haven't hurt yourself, have you, Chief? Not in a bunch of trouble, are you? I'm fine. Ah, good to hear. Guess I got nothing to worry about then. Gah ha The Peony Exploration Team is all about the safety and well-being of its members, after all. So you be careful on your way back to me, hear? No expedition's over until you're safe and sound back at home base. Gah ha ha! Jug on the current status of Legendary Clue 1. Calyrex, the king of Bountiful Harvest, was able to reconnect with its loyal ste steed using the reins of unity. Calyrex also seems to have regained its trust in humankind. 
As thanks for helping it regain its power, Calyrex is allowing me to take it along on my adventure. I didn't report back to Chief Peony. So is that why it's randomized? It's just Calyrex flipping me a big metal finger. Gotta be. No, it's actually just one room. I had given it the benefit of the doubt. I thought there was a place up there, but it's just one big room. Sure, it's a nice room, but it's not even outdoors. Well, I started taking a little bit to reflect formerly on the nature of existence and us finishing this. We're just going to play it back. Hey, man. Oi, oi, Chief. How's the adventure going? How's the adventure and anything to report? Legendary King of Bunny Harvest, Calyrex. What, you really caught Calyrex from the Legends? That's ultra mega brilliant. Report away. The fat. That noggin's massive. Eh, is that the King of Bonneful Harvest? The one calling the shots around here? Huh, could have sworn I've seen it before. Or I didn't get it, maybe not. Uh, anyway, it's definitely regal of it to have a steed. And that massive head does sort of resemble a crown. Keenly enough, at any rate. Let's just call this a successful expedition. Looks like you've reported all there is to the report at Legendary Clue 1 and the King of Bonneville Harvest. Mash and I'll mark this exploration done. Calyrex, King of Bonneville Harvest. Anything else you want, Legendary, you want to talk about? Need to expedite you. Did I have a Calyrex at one point? I don't think so. But I also can't shake the feeling that I might have. No, I don't see one in my death box, and I don't see one in my box box. I thought I had one, though. I thought I caught one. Uh, I'm gonna go back inside to heal up real quick. And then we're going to go find a burb. Because just like with Kupfu, I don't know if I can find the... Uh, the, uh... I uh, Cryogonal. That's his name. I don't know if I can find the Cryogonal that I need. Get Frederick's. But, I do know the burbs are out there somewhere. So let's see if we can find a burb. Find a burb. Find a burb. Find a burb. Play all legendary hunting expeditions and report back to Chief Peony. What's that? Oh. Mustard. I had no idea where these things hang out, by the way. Like, at all. What was the clue for Regis Yellow? Something about a ring. Got to try to figure that out. The rude. Maybe, or melodic. Okay, there's a score bunny under my tire. Um. I don't remember seeing a cryogonal at any point. Oh well, I'm not gonna worry about it. Pangoro. Okay. It's this way. Look for it. I'm sorry about that. I was on some of the arena muck for a burb for a minute. And if we can't find it, I'm going to do the registeel hint. I'm going to try to figure out the registeel hint. And I'm. Hello. Hello. Should I just roll where I 
big birds hang out. Because I want it to be random, but we all know it's not random. It would be easy to notice once we're near it, though. They glow. They literally glow. See, that's just a regular Porygon. Ooh, that's super right. What? I'm not near anything! This Porygon just shot- Hey, man, fight me! No, I'll, I'll fight you. This music's so good, though. I'll fight you. Okay. Next level. Trace somewhere, or I mean, obviously not. There's not a Moltres, right? Not even evil, spooky Moltres. Not actually here, not actually here, not actually here. I can't go up. I want to say that it would be up. But uh, of course I do. It's bird. Leave me alone. Mm. Yeah, that's right. I need to get a load. Oh no, not snow warning. Ha! Ah, I win. I wonder if I still have any more powers. I might. Found a bird, guys! Oh, I found another bird. Ooh, this is pretty neat. The answer is out of the tunnel, that's where I want to be. Yeah. Are they all going to be like, I mean, it's not going to be like Articuno. It's not going to have three of them and I have to find the right one. I don't think I've ever realized I'm just get that logo on top. Leave me alone. That kind of looks like it through a little bit. I can't touch you, so I don't want you. Intrepid sword. Haven't been here in a while, though. It's nice to be back. Might honestly be best to cut until I find the bird and then come back. But I think we can just hang out and do a little bird hunting together. Bird watching, if you will. Although I would really like to. No, I can't even fly anywhere here. Great. I'm gonna fly to the top and search my way down, but guess we're not doing that, uh huh? Okay. Not a bird. Ooh, is there any birds in the forest? Birds live in the forest sometimes, right? <laughs> oh, I have no idea what I'm doing. That's so obvious. Max Mushroom, but we're not really in need of those. Those guys don't care what you want. Ooh, a Garcia twig. Training lowlands. Yes, up there. That's where I wanted to go. Did you see a regular Zapdos? Yes, I did. What if Galarian and Moltres got recognized? Galarian and Moltres. They're in Can't tell me in Moltres. 
Wait, 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 I just saw something flying. Well, I'm sure it's not what I was after. I did just see something flying. Sunlight is harsh. Intrepid sword. Nope, you're not going. Here, did another one. That could have been so easy, man. What about up here? Anything? Besides some Dynamax and Ranger? Some wattage? Okay. I don't know if I have patience here for this. I'm so just saw a giant bird. Hope so on your team. Gee, I wonder why. Weird, right? Where's our other Zapdos? Is that out? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. There's no way it's over the water, right? Isn't it? Is it still a fire type? Or is it just dark? Dark flying. Okay, I'm gonna look up where to find the star. I will be right back. No, so apparently. Okay. Sure, why not? Apparently, it literally just floats around the island, so we're gonna have to sit in one spot by the workout dojo and wait for it. Otherwise, there is no way to guarantee it or even to find it. Nope, didn't want to say guitar, I wanted to be with Blade. <laughs> Never mind, it doesn't matter. Also, it's apparently a dark flying type, it's not fire. Which is good, because that wouldn't have lost take Masashi out of the front. <laughs> no, I don't need to, not even resist one of its stabs that are neutral to the other. Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. Go away, go away, go away. I'm looking up, I'm not seeing anything up there though. I would like to at least catch a glimpse of it so I know what Pokemon to look out for. Apparently it flies around in a predetermined path. Which is boring, and why isn't Zapdos the one that just runs around? But if you can get into a boxing match with Zapdos... Uh, obviously there's no way of that ever happening or ever working, but that would just be so funny. Yara! Me alone. No one likes you. That... Jinx is just a floating Jinx, okay. It also moves faster than you, so you can't even chase it, which is not fair. I don't know, this entire thing just feels like busy work. Not all the Isle of Armor, or not all the Crown Tundra, but definitely the birds. Otherwise, why would they separate out like that? Other than to get you to go back and hang out in places you've already finished. I think you should always have one shot to try to catch it. Like, it always starts in one place or something. Hey, man. Okay. Got for fighting. I got for fighting with Porygon Z, too. This is the second Porygon Z that's assaulting me in this episode. Sacred Sword, get out of here. Okay. It was a very close battle, but we did manage to just barely edge out the uh, Porygon Z. Soon frisky there, though, for a second, man. I'm telling you. Zapdos, come on, come on, wherever you are. Okay, I'm in front of the Master Dojo. I'm hiding behind a rock. 
I have absolutely no idea what this will look like. So I guess we'll be back when we find the bird. As I wait. Where are you, Moltres? Why can't I find you? I want to be done with this quest. Down the thing. Good song. Okay, let's try looping back. Seeing if it's. No, I keep thinking it's Porygon Z, but it's not. I. I don't think it is. It is the stupid Porygon Z. So there's just no light there. Come on. Why doesn't this poor Moltres have a light on, like? I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. No, I don't want to fight you. I don't want to fight you, Maiden Pilotic. Pilotic is so engraved with the name Mavis for me that I literally can't help but call it anything. I call it Mavis. I can't call it anything else. I can't even say Pilotic half the time. Don't leave, don't leave, don't leave, don't leave, don't leave. Yes. Fight me! Okay, so that's why the Porygon Z was absolutely nowhere near me, and that's why I had different black and really good music. It's because it was a stupid bird all along. Maybe the real bird was the glitch that we found along the way. You know? Okay. That's it, I'm manning the charger when I catch you. Yep, yes I am. So do they have different video games where it was all the same thing, but I misunderstand what's happening with the Articuno. The Articuno double teamed and played around, but... For what? Is that like, it? Do they all have a different video game? And... Tag, whatever, whatever, or... Did I just get like super lucky with this spawning here a hundred times? A hundred times, ten thousand times I have tried, but these feelings are not for wins. Uh, Sally has like one of the lowest attacks on my team, so I'm gonna switch out to Sally and Dark pulls up. And all that does something. I already killed you, wouldn't worry you want. Wait, is this the same Borgon Z that ambushed me earlier? Is this the third time I'm fighting this thing? Oh, I'm so mad. <gasps> Flash out! Flash out! Come on, the crowd! Okay. Nope, I don't want to hit you again, because I don't think I can with literally anything. So I would just like to throw some punch balls, and I would like you to stay inside of one, and I will make treasure, and I will make another stupid joke about friendship we along our way, and... Okay. Yep, you're so cool and unique doing that, you know? I've never seen anyone do that before, you know? Never. Never, ever. Oh, leave me alone. Thundershock. I'm not an actual movie yet. I don't have any like sleep too. I am not throwing. Thousand waves. You think thousand waves? One rollout is not gonna kill, but I don't know how many rollouts I'm gonna get. That's just the problem, dude. Come on. Instruct. No! Laurel, Laurel. Come on. No. 
And we have to do this again, don't we? The fact that I killed it here has something to do with the fact that it keeps respawning here. Will that always respawn back to where you can paint it? Go over here and fight me, a big old loser. Not you! I don't want to deal with this. Leave me alone. We could have had a Galarian Moltres. Hey, 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 you big old loser! No, you can't catch it. It's faster than you. I thought we could catch it for a second, and I was like, oh, thank goodness, maybe this isn't what it needed. But I think it is, but nope. Dang it! Now I didn't respawn here, and I was gonna keep not respawning here, right? I am catching the stupid bird. I will be right back. I will be back. And I will have a virus with me. Okay, I'm going to come back to the reset. That's not the point. Now I don't have to attack it. Because it's just going to make me attack it again. Why does that work? Why can't you just tell me to attack? You're my Pokemon. I'm telling you not to attack. So don't. Uh... This is painful. This is why I hate catching legendaries. It's just so obnoxious. Like, obviously this is an actual legendary, but I had 50% HP and it was it wasn't even shaking three times in its balls, was it? Legendaries are even worse than that. Pretty ignore the number that I've caught. Here. Look at that no metal example over. No metal just absolutely refused to be my friend, even though with that one HP and paralyzed or sleeping or both, I think what it actually was. One, two, buckle my shoe, three, four. Okay, he likes to hear some of okay. <gasps> so, what I have to do, guys, if you want to catch Larry and Mo Trains, is just start singing nursery rhymes. One, two, buckle my shoe. Three, four, close the door. Is it five, six, pick up six? I don't know. I don't care. I don't know why I put the joke carry on this one. It wasn't funny to begin with. It certainly isn't now. Treasure is going in the box and I hope to never see it again. You caught Porygonzi, one of the legendary bird Pokemon from the clue. That is on the current status on Legendary number 3. Beep, 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 beep. Oi, oi, it's Beep Yoni. How's your expedition going? Come again, you put the Legendary Pokemon for a gun seat. <laughs> I'm gonna try to something. I'm gonna try to kill the other bird, Pokemon. Yeah, I hope it is. It's just so funny. Okay, you'll be out of here. Where did I find Regis Deal? Okay, okay. What's that? The Roaring Seas Cave. Oh, I don't even know where I found Regis Deal, do I? Is it down here? Oh, I guess that's it. I was gonna try to. Yeah, I was gonna read the clue for Regis Deal so I could. Maybe remember and maybe get it done. They don't remember where we found it. And it doesn't appear to be cooperating. I guess that's it for this episode. I don't want to remember anyway. Thank you all so much for watching. Have a great day. And I will see you next time. Brief addendum for this episode that you saw just now. It's been seconds. The Mewtwo I mentioned earlier, he's right there. So, there he is. I was just talking about you. How did you know? How did you know? 
Why are you here? Why did you know? I really... So... Thanks, me, for speaking this into existence. I didn't crunch because it's fun. And that's just... Okay. And now, here we all this time. Thank you all so much for watching, and have a great day.